struggling to manage your inventory, orders and sales across multiple marketplaces? You are not alone. But what if there is a tool you could connect everything under one roof? Yes, there are many multi-channel tools to help you there. And today we are going to talk about one of the finest multi-channel software, Rhythm, previously known as Channel Advisor, because it's the new name of CA. I still prefer to call it Channel Advisor, as it is widely known. Hello everyone, this is Shakhawat from Ecom Clips. And in today's video, I will give you an overview of Channel Advisor, show you how to integrate your marketplaces, upload products, and more. So without any further delay, let's get started. So what exactly Rhythm is? Rhythm, also known as Channel Advisor, is an online tool that connects multiple online business channels. It works in the cloud, meaning you can use it from anywhere. It connects to different websites, online store and social media to make selling easier and better. It helps manage stats, improve performance and grow the business. For example, if you have stores on Amazon, Walmart and Etsy, Channel Advisor will connect them all in one place. It helps you manage your products, orders and sales, so that you do not need to frequently visit all the stores you have. It also connects your social media like Facebook and Instagram, so you can also sell there. It makes everything simple and organized. You can sell more and grow your business without the hassle. Okay, now what I'm going to do is, I will go through the most effective service of Channel Advisor, showing its interface, going to introduce its feature a bit. But first, let's see what the interface look like. Well, I have opened Channel Advisor. Here you can see, this is what the interface look like. On the top, you can see the tabs, Home, Advisor, Products, Sell, Fulfill, Marketing and Help. If you look closely, then you see that we are on the Home tab now. To be specific, we are on the Home's dashboard. On the right corner, this is the Action button. If you click, there are several options you will find. Rename clone, change layout or delete. And beside that, this is the date range. You can see your dashboard by date. On the left side, this is the GMB trend by channel. GMB means gross merchandise volume. Here you can see your selling status. This is your currency. This is for which currency you want to see. And if I scroll down, here you see the pie chart. Here you are seeing your different marketplace info. All right, this is a short view of what the interface look like. I think you got basic idea. Now the first thing you have to do is marketplace integration. We already mentioned that Channel Advisor connects multiple marketplaces, but how many? Well, you will be surprised that Channel Advisor allows you to connect to more than 420 marketplaces. And to do so, on your interface, go to Cell, click here, find a channel, all right? You will be landed on another page. Now here you will see the list of marketplaces. If you scroll down, you will find many of them. All right. Finding your desired marketplace manually can bother you. In the left corner, you can see a search bar. Now type your desired marketplace. Let's search Frugo for example. Here this appears. Now you have to click on connect. A box will appear like this. Now select your country. I am selecting US for now. Click continue and this will appear then. Here you need to give your account information such as your seller ID and your access token fill up appropriately at below this is the checkbox if you want to import an order with a mismatch you can select this checkbox all right now you can click on the save button and your marketplace is integrated now i think you got this okay now let's see how you can upload your products we can add products to channel advisor by adding them one by one manually or by bulk uploading so let's see the process first we are going to add a single inventory manually also known as creating a SKU. Here on the screen, in the product tab, this is the catalog. Here at the right corner, when you go to create new button, you will find some option. Click on products. From there, here you can see the types. Standard, parent and bundle. Standard would be auto selected. Okay. Click product. The first is basic info. In the basic info section, you need to fill in your SQ. Your title, subtitle, your brand name, manufacturer, condition, your ASIN, UPC code, and so on. Here, write your product description. And below that, put your product details information, height, width, length, weight, etc. If I go below, here you can fill in warranty information, tax code, your warehouse location. Okay, there are a lot of things to fill out. 
I think you got the idea. Make sure you have the necessary information. Okay, move on the next process. Let's say basic info is done. Now go to the level. Here you can select your marketplaces. All right, the next thing is pricing. Click on that. Not all information here is necessary to add, but you must add retail price. Buy it now price, store price, seller cost minimum price, maximum price. Now add quantity. Do it based on your information. Now come to attributes. Here you can see the attribute box for all the marketplaces you add. You can see Amazon titles, bullet points, description and so on. If you scroll down, here comes eBay's attributes and below you can see Walmart. You need to fill in all. Now select the image. Let's see how you can add images. Click imports new image. Select image. Now from your computer, select images you have already prepared. You can also drag and drop your images. Before uploading, you can select image placement. That means you can rearrange the placement of your images. Now click on upload. Hit save. All right, your product was listed. You can check this. Go to products, catalog. Here you can see that your products are listed. All right, this is all for today. If I show you all the process, that would be a way long video. So we are going to make a tutorial series on channel advisor. In the next video, we will show the process of bulk upload and other segments. Stay tuned with us. I hope this video helps you understand channel advisor basics. If you find this video helpful, subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon so that you never miss our helpful content. Also like and share this video. Thanks for being with us. I will catch you in the next one. Till then, stay safe.